Well, up for another? Up for another. Yeah, top three is technically winning. I'll take it then. But, oy. Some of these people. Yeah, do you know about attack order? It's super good to know as otherwise arcane. I know you attack from left to right. All the way down. At least I think that's it. And they attack randomly, like totally randomly, right? Like, they'll attack the front line first, but that's about it. Okay. Well, what do we have? I kind of want to try Sad Dracula. Pop the Magic Dragon is interesting, but Sad Dracula comboed with those monsters seems like a really good combo for beef cheese. Yeah, Sad Dracula can high roll or hit nothing. I'm gonna go for it. Let's see. Don't have anybody with a sleigh. Guess I'm gonna just grab her. Because at the very least, it's an easy treasure. I guess I could have just gone eeny meeny miny mo. I'm gonna lock it. We'll go for it. Now, who determines who attacks first? That's random. Okay. Let's see, any of these? No, I can't roll that. Yeah, there's a level 3 that's stupid good with Dracula. I think that's what we're going for. If we get really lucky. Now, here's a question. If a character has a slay ability and sad Dracula's move, can you proc them twice? Here's some options. I've got four. They stack. Okay. I'm thinking of going Mad Mim and then just popping sugar and spice to buff the rainbow unicorn. Is it good? No. Otherwise, we go. Now, let's go for it. I'm just going to make a big unicorn. I'll go for a second Mad Mim. Sure. Okay, so what is Celestial Tiger's ability? Ah, uh, double... Oh, gosh. That explains a lot. I lose, but it's fine. Okay, do I care for Polywoggle? Nah, not in this scenario. Darkwood Creeper would have actually been kind of good. Oh, there we go. That's him. Everybody except for the Sleeping Princess from this lineup actually is kind of useful. I do kind of wish I had ended up with a Treant instead, just because if I could get that to just start getting a couple of kills, it's not bad. Yeah, the question is, do I want to roll any meeny miny mo and just hope for the best? I might. Maybe. 
Because the thing is, like, Shadow Assassin would be... Well, I mean, is our primo. I think I'll just go Shadow Assassin and Unicorn. The Darkwood Creeper, eh, maybe isn't as good as I think it would be. Cripes! Oh, that didn't work out. I was expecting a little bit more oomph, but that is a very beefy boy. Oh, do I want to go Darkwood Creeper, or do we just get another Rainbow Unicorn? Or... I'm just going to pop that, and we get something. Your animals are good, have one of them. 1-1. One, one. Locked chest. Um, hilariously enough, Crown of Atlas kind of works. Let's go with locked chest. Because I'm not feeling most of these. Okay, and we get the Darkwood Creeper, who's not as good as the Unicorn. I'm going to sell the Mad Mim. Get another Unicorn. I don't know if that's actually worth it, but I don't think I'm going to be sticking with the Mad Mibs. I could have sold the Cinderella. Yeah, I don't know. But as long as we get a couple of kills, the Shadow Assassin starts scaling. Reaper, I'm back. Um... Yeah. Yeah. It's highly unlikely it's going to nab any kills. Oh, that didn't work out exactly the way I needed it to. It's fine. I kind of hate doing that. But, like, it's probably worth it. Hey, thank you, Minimurgle, for the 500 bits. Since I'm a monster train junkie, I must ask, when's the sponsor's stream starting? Uh, soon, I guess. Sooner than later? I'm not entirely sure. Vampire double slays. Yeah, in retrospect, we'll put him there. And we'll move her up. There we go. I want to move the unit horn. Okay. That might be a bit better. But yeah, I, I might actually switch over to Monster Train after this. Ish. <laughs> The, the one immediate problem is that, like, I always hope to get up to numbers before I switch to Monster Train, which is the one problem. Or, or like, any sponsored segment. And unfortunately, these companies keep hiring me to do sponsored streams on my day off, which means I'm, like, fighting an up uphill battle of, like, pulling numbers. Because they're all like, you should have your, like, average numbers and whatnot. And I'm like, you're hiring me to stream on the day off where people aren't, like, oh god. They're gonna do the thing, aren't they? That didn't work. Uh, let's see, this is good. Uh, let's see, any of the rest of these good? Princes or princesses? Last breath behind me. No, but I'll grab him. Okay. Bad moon. Okay, put him there. Then we're gonna grab... Um... Oh, uh, do we... There we go. Adventure is Pog. Adventure is good. I'll try it. Not worth locking for? Alright. 
I just need to snag a couple of kills, and this gets kind of stupid. I hope. But yeah, bad moon. Whenever they trigger a slay ability, give it 1-1 one, one permanently. And if we're lucky, that's going to be the whole front line just getting kind of silly. But I gotta get some kills, and it really depends on if... Well, I'm, oh gosh, yeah, I'm running. Wow, that kind of worked against me, didn't it? This is gonna work out, though. Unfortunately, now it's my backline attacking, which is not as helpful. I'll take it. Alright. First character you buy has 2-2 permanently, or I think I'm just going to go Merlin's Hat. Okay, so what do we have? We do have a Hungry Hungry Hippocampus, which is hilarious. I already ha am maxed out on Vainpire. I don't think I have enough animals on this one. Uh, reroll. Medusa wouldn't be a bad move. Or that. <laughs> what do we got across the board here? I have Mad Mim. I'm mixed. Mixed on a lot of these. Lock for the... Lock for the Medusa? Eventually I'd like to get it so that the... Medusa is proccing the River Wish mermaid so she just gets silly. And I... Yeah. Uh, let's see, I would get rid of the... Oh. Nope, it kills itself, damn it. Yeah, Medusa needs the mam Mad Mim. I'm going to sell the Vampire. I don't think he is that useful here. Yeah, the Mim... Well... Here. What if I do this? Because that Unicorn's already kind of good enough. This way, the Medusa's a little bit buffed up. Buff her a little bit harder. That way, that way she can get the kill. Uh, let's see. You get the first attack. Every brawl. Okay, that. That's big. But there's no way that I can get it. Oh, there we go. It's not perfect, but it'll do. I'm going to just sell this. The other... Getting the full Tableau Unicorn is not going to be worth it. This way she'll at least get the guaranteed kill, which gives a little bit of damage, and then we can switch. Yeah, let the moon grow her a little. Oh yeah, because we... We have both Sad Vampire and the Moon. Oh, well, she gets the buff. I'm not getting quite enough of those sleigh bonuses, unfortunately. Oh, there's the Medusa. Okay. When you buy a spell that costs two or less, cast it twice. And we're going to replace... Shit.
Can I cancel? No. In that case, I might get rid of Merlin's hat. Because the other ones are just too good. Okay. And none of these are incredible. There's another unicorn if I want it. It's like... Okay. Grab the fireball just so. It really wants me to use... Oh, I get that unicorn. No. Yeah, what I want to do is replace Cinderella, ideally with a Chupacabra, to be honest. Let's see. And here's the other option. I'm actually going to move my Shadow Assassin up at this point. Cinderella is trash and should be, probably be replaced. Oh, I give a character a 3-3. Three, three. I win if it's permanent. Or, it's permanent if I win. That sounds good. And I'm actually... I'm going to grab that instead. And it's evil. Well, that's either going to work out poorly for me or who knows what. I'm just going to roll down until we find something good. Or we find nothing good. Yeah, the real answer is we want to... Ooh, Wretched Mummy would have been good. Mummy, mummy is good. I just... Yeah, I'll grab the mummy. No, I'm gonna unlock it. Mummy is good, I'll get it, but it's not lockable good. It doesn't really work with this build. This is a spooky group. Okay. There we go. Working better. I'm baffled by the fact that I haven't found another Shadow Assassin yet. Okay, grab him. Don't think I care about the rest of these guys. Oh, that's convenient. Alright. Start of each brawl. Or... Double the abilities of all of your other treasures. Goodbye, Forking Rod. I don't know what doubling the Hermes boots does. Alternatively, no, we're getting... I think I'm going to get rid of the Hermes boots. It seems like a terrible mistake here. Yeah, it does nothing for the boots. But this way... Um, oh, it is so tempting. It is so tempting to lock for a quad flourish. It wouldn't be a double flourish, it would be a quad flourish. Or a triple flourish. I'm gonna go for it. It just seems super worth it, making Rotten Apple Tree into something beastly. Right, I'm gonna move Rop Rotten Apple Tree to the front-ish. Yeah, unfortunately I got rid of the boots, but... Worst comes to worst, yeah. Slay bonus is super obscene. I think we get 2-2 two, two every time we kill something. Which just sounds really good. Oh.
There we go. Unfortunately, a slay only works on an intentional attack, but you know what? Fine by me. This is a pretty good crew. It's going to take something real stinky to take me out at this point. I'd probably want to switch out Mad Mim at this point, just because I don't think I need her. Uh, let's see. Anyway, we're going to flourish. I don't know how many times that triggered, but suffice to say, I think it was a lot. Okay. So I'm going to grab Grumble Gore. Could have gone with Lady of the Lake, but I think Grumble Gore maybe. What about these guys? Oh boy. There's the Chupacabra. Oh. There is also the Green Knight. Do I want to go for Get Rid of Cinderella? Do we get rid of the River Wish Mermaid? No. So I could take Chupacabra. He'd be lovely. I was thinking of maybe going Green Knight, though. But I don't have quite enough. Well, I guess I, in retrospect, I should have just had that this entire time. I'm a fool. A lock. I don't know. Ow. Ow. Well, one way or another, it still win. Doesn't matter. <laughs> but yeah, the double river wish, wish mermaid actually works just about as well. I just want to get the third one. Oh. I would echo where it would work in this one. I'm going to buy it under the assumption that it's going to be great. Not well. Good to know. Oh, well, finally get one of those. And not many bonuses available. So Echo Wood can't gain permanent. Uh, cannot gain, like, permanent buffs. Only temporary ones. Ah, uh, it only procs off a of temporary. Got it. I'm gonna move. She's fine at this point, I think. I think I'll have the Shadow Assassin over he... No. I know, because I want the Medusa to go first. 50-50. So what are we up against? Chop sells an extra animal. Animal, the Pied Piper. I've beaten this guy a couple of times, though, I think. Oh, boy. Never mind. Wait, what? Is Overflow? I... What? I'm very confused as to what's going on right now. Well... As long as it's not a consistent bug, I think we're okay. Boy, this is going to give me a... This... Thank you for feeding me, Solar Bear. I will feast upon your animals. Oh. I mean, that vulture is a little spooky, but... Like, shit, half the things I've got... Are just going to consume it. There we go. I got a little dicier than I wanted, but that's fine. Alright. 
Evil Dragon. And there's Storm King. Who is just good. I don't know who I'd switch him for. That's the one problem. I'll live with that. The same thing with the mummy. It's like it's a little too late. I'm gonna grab the fireball. That could get really funny. Nope. Ah, oh, that's a big group. Kind of works out. Kind of. This is messy. And not in the best way. Okay. I lose this one. I might actually lose as a result of that. Nope, didn't. Oh, RNG was not happy on that one. Well. That's good. Uh, let's see. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I, mm. That's kind of good. I'm just going to get rid of Grumblegore. There's no room for her at this point. Same thing with these two. We're just going to use that to roll. See if we get what we're looking for. We do not. I probably should have actually gotten another Shadow Assassin out. Maybe? Maybe. All right. Oh, good. I'm just fighting a, a total rando. This would have been a really good round for Friendly Spirit, to be honest. Let's see. Keeping your sixes for a six treasure is worth it. I guess. That's probably fair. Ow. Rude. Oh, that sucks. I mean, it's fine, frankly. There we go. It's unfortunate that they're not hitting Rotten Apple Tree as much as I'd like. I'm just gonna grab that guy. In the off chance we find a second one. Hey, that's better, though. And I'm going to skip those for a little bit of extra money. Hmm. There is Oni King. That's really good. Okay. Give your treants plus attack equal to my health is brawl. Wow. That's really good. But I don't have enough treants to really justify it. Up assassin and tree. Let's do that. I guess it doesn't really matter. It's because I have Horn of Olympus. I'm just going to sell that guy, and plus attack permanently. Frankly, I'm just going to give it to the tree. Okay. 
Let's see how this goes. Last time I fought this guy, it was a bit rough. Oh boy, that's a beefy Juliet shit. Well, there goes beefy Juliet. As far as characters potentially beefing themselves out, I think we're okay. Wow, what the hell happened there? Shoot. Wait! I got it! I just barely got it. Okay. Lucky coin. Oh, permanently upgrade a character. Yeah, it's worth it. Okay. Uh, do I do anything else? I can't do anything else. Alright, DeGill, let's see if it's you. It's you versus me. Yeah, the real question is if I get to attack first with the Medusa or the Shadow Assassin, we win. I might want to switch. No. No, no, no. Switching them does not does me no good. Wait, did the other guy die to another guy? I don't think... I think he died the previous round. Assassin in the back. Seems reasonable. Yeah, that's a good point. Goodbye, River Wish Mermaid. Kind of worked out. That's unfortunate. Got it. Got it. Bam. Oh yeah, you can really tell he was looking for something. I just got lucky with knighthood. All right. I got a crown. I feel good about myself. That is a good stopping point, though. Because, you know, when it comes down to it, uh, it's it's nice to end on a win, at least for now. But that was such a good run. I was like, all right, we're just going to try and high roll with Sad Dracula and just hope for the best. And we got it. We got it good.